A poster is always prepared with a particular target audience in mind. Posters can be used for publicizing and highlighting the following these things. The poster should be clear in communicating the intended message in an essentially readable manner. Hello students, I am Anil, Assistant Professor of English, Vidyashram First Grade College, the Temple of Excellence, Mysore. In this session, we are going to look at poster writing or brochure writing for the students of third semester BCA. So what is a poster? In this session, we are going to look at the meaning of the poster, uses of the poster, types of poster, points to remember when you create a poster and some solved examples. So what is a poster? You people know what poster is, but how do you define it? How do you understand or how do you make people understand what a poster is? Meaning of the poster. A poster is a very useful means of creating awareness about current social problems or needs and issues or to even extend public invitations. You can easily understand here, a poster is a very useful means of creating awareness about social problems or needs and issues or to even extend invitations to people publicly extending invitations to people essentially a very brief communication with a powerful visual and a powerful message powerful visual and powerful message a poster is always prepared with a particular target audience in mind so here we create a poster using create a poster keeping in mind a particular group of people it very clearly mentions the theme or the topic the schedule of an event and the occasion for it it mentions everything what is it talking about and where is the event happening if there is an event the poster should be clear in communicating the intended message in an essentially readable manner when somebody looks at a poster it should show all these qualities. It should be clear in communicating the intended message. What is the message it is trying to convey? Then that should be in, in, in an easily readable manner. When somebody reads it, people should not feel it difficult. It should be very easy. It has to be captivating, attractive and persuasive so as to influence a large number of people. A poster should be like this. When somebody looks at it, it should be very captivating. It should capture the attention of the reader. It should be very attractive and persuasive. When somebody reads it, they should have this sense of doing it when it is read. So as to influence a large number of people. This is what a poster is. So why do we use poster? What is the use of a poster? Posters can be used for publicizing and highlighting the following these things. A cultural show, an exhibition, a seminar, a workshop, a fair, a feat, etc. So we can use these posters or we use these posters for publicizing all these things. If there is a cultural show in the college, we make posters, we put color, color photos, which talk about the events being organized. If there is an exhibition, you might have seen the posters. Take for example, Dasra exhibition. When Dasra is approaching, people put large posters saying that there is exhibition, that would be in Mysore. Then seminars in the colleges, if there is a seminar, we make posters. If there is a workshop, then also we will make some posters, a fair, a feat, etc. Educational institutions and students activities. In order to publicize an educational institution or students activities, we use posters. We put different types of photographs of the event, then we give some attractive phrases so that the onlookers or the readers will easily understand what it is about for promoting sales of a product or service. It is also like the advertisement which we have previously studied in the previous session. It also has the same thing, promoting sales of a product or service. Influencing public opinion. For In advertisements, you are actually trying people to buy your service or a product, but here, you are using it to influence the opinion of the public, posters, then advancing the social cause and so on. 
So why are these posters used? When people read the posters, they are moved. Therefore, you are advancing a social cause and etc. Therefore, you use posters. Types of posters for awareness of a social problem. A social poster. How do you understand a social awareness poster? So, here you use details associated with the theme. For example, stop child labor. Then save water. New symptoms to look out for. When the corona broke out in the world, these posters were there on the social media. Stop child labor. This has been there for many years. Saving water is still relevant. So these are the social cause. Details associated with the theme. Effect of the problem. So what happens when people go through that? You can show through the picture. Solution to the problem. You can bring out the solution and make people realize its effects. Any additional useful information. So if there is any useful information, you can mention it in your posters. So one thing is for awareness purpose, we use posters. This is awareness poster. After awareness poster, you can use the poster for an event. Those become event posters. For example, name of the event, you can mention here, 2022 music party. It is talking about a music party. Then the purpose, day, time, venue, entry tickets or passes, if there are any tickets or passes, any other relevant information, highlights of the event. So based on the intention of the poster, we divide them into groups, social awareness posters and event posters. You can see here, these are party posters. Points to keep in mind, when you create a poster, what are the things that you should, should keep in mind? A poster is designed to be put up at a public place, so it should be designed in such a way that it catches the attention of the passers-by. So posters are displayed in front of public. So when you create a poster, it should attract the readers. Then a poster should have bigger, bold capital letters because it is read by the public from a distance. So when these posters are created, you should use bigger letters because when people look at it, they do not come towards it and then read. They are passing by and then it should catch their attention. Therefore, it should be printed on or written with bold letters and bigger letters. A poster should not have any extra or irrelevant matter. Just like advertisements, a poster should also contain only relevant information. Then a poster can be made more catchy by using phrases, slogans and attractive language. So here you can bring out your creative thoughts. You should, can use a catchy phrase. You can make slogans and use them or you can use attractive language so that people get to register those events in their minds. The poster should always be put in a rectangular box, just like advertisements. Posters should also be in a rectangular box. Poster. Keep this thing in mind. Some solved examples for you. You are the creative director of Times I. Bank of Chennai. Create a poster to create awareness about eye donation among people. People are recently doing it. They are registering for donating their organs. Particularly eye donation. So how do you do it? A rectangular box first. Then donate eyes and live long after you are no more remembered. So catchy phrase, catchy sentences. Eye donation highlighted. What is this poster about? Eye donation. Blindness. Is a curse, isn't it? So blindness is a curse. Be light for somebody's life. Bliss to the sightless, blindness checks potential, hinders development. Blindness checks potential, hinders development. What is the effect of blindness? It checks potential. People cannot realize their potential and it hinders their development. Act now, create waves of happiness around you. So when you are no more, let your body parts be the light for somebody's life. Contact the Times iBank Chennai. Your timely action can help countless people. So this is how you give all the relevant information in the poster. When people look at it, they 
are attracted towards it and this information reaches them. Incidents of road rage are increasing day by day. Draft posted in 50 words on behalf of the Delhi Traffic Police providing road safety tips. You may have noticed these things in newspapers as well. In newspapers, the traffic police give advertisements through posters. So how is it done? Two minutes of rash driving may result in death. So when these words are highlighted, people read it. They are attracted towards it and they want to know what is it talking about. Drive carefully, follow traffic rules. Therefore, they come to know that yes, we should follow traffic rules. Do not use mobile phones while driving. People usually do it. Don't mix drink and drive. We know it, but we still do it. Don't overtake from the wrong direction. Drive in your lane. Wear helmet for two-wheelers. Wear seat belts in cars issued by the Delhi Traffic Police. So these common things and with a beautiful picture and these words attracting people's attention. Now the information has reached the readers or the public. This is how you use the posters for spreading awareness. So you understood what a poster is. Then you understood how to write a poster. Now you know some examples how to write a poster, how to attract people. Keeping all these things in mind, there is a brief, there is a very thin line between advertisements and posters. In advertisements, you give the relevant information to reach the people who are interested in it. But posters are used to create awareness as well. Advertisement is for commercial purposes, mainly for commercial purposes. Posters are both for commercial purpose and awareness purpose. And to make people aware of the events going on in a particular place or institution, etc. So keep these things in mind, how to write a poster. It should be written in a rectangular box. You can use catchy phrases, you can use attractive language, you can use the pictures to display your thoughts and you should mention relevant information. What is it about? Where is it happening? At what time? If there is passes or tickets, where to buy? So you should mention all these things in a poster. With all these things in mind, we shall meet in the next class with the next or a new, with a new topic. Thank you.